always the chocolate. This small ice cream shop in the town of New Scotland is bustling with customers once again. Two hamburgers, two clam rolls, two onion rings, two fries. This summertime staple serves up juicy burgers, crispy fries, battered clam rolls, and gourmet ice cream. Ooh, that looks yummy. But the Tasty Treat Shop off of Route 85 serves up so much more than delicious soft serve. Here you go, cherry chocolate chunk. It offers a taste <laughs> of nostalgia. This place establishes so many memories that like it makes you want to come back. Like you think happy thoughts when you think of Tasty Treat. I used to come here almost every weekend as a kid and this was easily my favorite spot to go. As locals flock to this seasonal favorite, there were concerns its glory days were over. It had been closed and put up for sale with little interest. That is, until Jeffrey Clark came along. The uh, chocolate vanilla twist. Chocolate That's vanilla. my favorite, yeah. He's the new owner and a lifelong local. Thank you for coming. After recently retiring from a career in finance, this Harvard grad cashed out some of his investments to bring the beloved tasty treat back to life. This was always a place, you know, as I remember, that was a, you know, just a great place for community to come together. To come here and people to converse and have a good time together and uh, had a great, great community feel to it. And I want to bring that back. Before Clark bought this, it sat vacant for two years. It shut down in the pandemic and then the owner was diagnosed with cancer and forced to sell. And that's when Clark drove by and saw the for sale sign, which sparked a memory. And I've always had a, a, a great affection for this community. I grew up here and uh, when I saw it was for sale, I just, I don't know what happened. I planted a seed. When I was a kid, I was a, a baseball player in uh, at Kalana's uh, Little League and we used to come here after the games. And as I started reflecting on um, what this place was in my past and, 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 the, and the, the idea of, you know, uh, bringing that back. Well, that idea is now becoming a reality, a place where you'll once again find kids after ball games, neighbors greeting neighbors, and parents spending time with their kids. I'm gonna do the same exact thing, make those memories, and you know, hopefully it's awesome that he's doing that, open this place back up. For Clark. How's the ice cream? That community connection is the cherry on top. You know, people come here and interact um, with other people in the community, or even outside of this immediate community. And, uh, and enjoy each other. And for me, that's just extremely rewarding because I'm part of it. Julie Chapman, Spectrum News.